speech and only driving me tactics and being important. So, we want to make sure the president announces this commission in February. That way we can roll out in March. Suppose we get into the 11th of February and there's no announcement by the president yet. Operative and keyword, yet. February 11, 2024, Super Bowl 53 takes place in Las Vegas, Nevada. Now, I don't know about you all, but that's prime time. That's about as big of an event as there's going to be early on in the year. We can make some noise in a lot of creative ways to get the message across. And we don't need that many people either. No, 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 not at all. Because any type of disruption, any type of thing that's an anomaly is going to get picked up real quick. Remember, we're talking about 2024. Everything is going to be intense. If we have about three to five people there, unfurl a banner that says reparations now, cut the check. At that Super Bowl, them cameras going to turn to that and they're going to see. It doesn't matter if there's like a bunch of people. You could just have three to four people there doing Hey, if everybody goes there with a t-shirt that says, cut the check, reparations now, that's going to be picked up by the media and the cameras. We can do a lot. Yeah. A few people can do a lot. And that's going to get picked up traction. See, we need to make a spectacle, a scene. We need to come out swinging. If they haven't established that commission by the 11th of February, we better go to Super Bowl 53 and make some noise. Period. Yeah. Because that's going to be the moment when everybody, all eyes of the nation, are going to be watching that football game. And that's when we make our move. Yeah. Now, somebody said, what about if folks are arrested? will be legal is going to be moving they're going to be working all year legal if folks get arrested for making a spectacle or a scene they're going to be in and out process fingerprinted photographed and out you know that's a big opportunity for football man. in las vegas on the 11th of february that's a big opportunity Opportunities like that don't come around too often. And all we got to do is make a little noise. Somebody might show up and want to make a lot of noise. Some people might show up and want to make a lot of noise. If we're making a little noise, a lot of noise, I'd rather we make some type of noise on that day, that event. Everybody's going to be paying attention. Yeah. It doesn't matter what we do, billboards, anything, anything you can think of, yeah, billboards, having people outside in Las Vegas as they're entering the arena, standing outside with reparation signs, it doesn't matter, it doesn't matter, yeah, and people think it needs to be a lot of people, no, it can be two people, three people, four people. That's a lot. The media is going to pick it up. We just need to gain a little bit of traction, a little bit of momentum. Yeah. All we need is a little bit. Because that's going to catch fire. Yeah, that's going to catch fire. It's like when you have a little bit of 
tears it and you lie in bed. And I mean a lot. And then after Super Bowl last bracket time and done, it's in Black History Month and the 11th of February is probably right around the State of the Union. Yeah. You gotta think, you gotta give these politicians notice. You gotta constantly put pressure on them. It's not the fact that they might not even want to do it. They need to be pressured. They need to see they have the support from the citizenry. They need to see. If they start seeing that they got the support, they're gonna go with it. Yeah. They're gonna roll with it. They see 20, 30 of you all at the Super Bowl do something like that, it's gonna pick up quickly. Yeah. And I think we definitely got more than 30 people out in Las Vegas that can make some noise. Stop playing with me. We got some real heavy hitters out in Las Vegas. Yeah, I know Vegas. I know Vegas. We're gonna be out there quite a bit. I know Vegas, I know Reno, I know Sparks, I know Carson City, all of them places. We got some people. We can make some noise if we want to. And we're going to need to make some noise. And this Super Bowl, that's prime time. You all don't let that opportunity slip away. Yeah, make some noise. Even if you're coming in from out of state, say a bunch of people from Oakland want to come to Vegas. That's just not too far away. Make a plan and make some noise. Good trouble. Yeah. I'm going to be doing a lot of other things. Believe you me, you're going to see me out there. Yeah. Don't worry. When it gets really, really hot, you're going to be out. But before, you know, before March, before that kickoff, the real push to get this underway. If we do something like this in February, make some noise at the Super Bowl game, even if it's a handful of people. Somebody said five people won't register on the scale. Yes, they will. You really don't understand what 2024 is going to be. Yes, it will register. If it's one person, if it's two people out there, it's going to register. That's going to gain traction. Because other people are going to see it all across the country. Yeah. All across the nation, people will see that. Yeah. I would get the bull horns, the loud horns, all the signs. I would get all of it. Get some chants. Cut the chant. All of it. T-shirts, everything. Yeah. And make some noise outside Las Vegas, outside that stadium. That's going to be a hell of a thing to watch. Because they're going to say, oh my goodness. We ain't seen this before. We ain't seen black Americans make no noise at no football game, no Super Bowl game. About getting their money. We ain't seen this before. Yeah, that's gonna make some noise. I'm telling you. And if the president hasn't, you know, declared that commission, seeing something like that, the vice president could go to the president and say, hey, if they can pull something like this off, they can keep getting momentum. See, this is what you all don't understand. It's psychological. That woman who told me there's going to be nobody but 20 people, the same 20 people, that's because she's not. She's kind of given up now. This has worn on for a long period of time and she really doesn't feel that it's going to be any different. People start seeing stuff like that yeah, they'll take note. They'll definitely take note and, they, and take stock of it, yeah.
because that can build a momentum for the commission if we don't have it by then. Hopefully we have it by then. Even if we had the commission by then, I would still go to the Super Bowl. I would still use that event to try to spark more. More. We need more, more, more. As many events as possible. I know people are going to do stuff in February, but we need a lot. And we need it when a lot of people are paying attention. No bigger event than the Super Bowl out in Las Vegas to me. Because California is a stone's throw away and we're supposed to be ready by March. We can do an early test shot across the bow and see what happens out in Vegas. You know, that'll test us for what's going to happen in March. We need some test runs. I think the Super Bowl is a good test run. Yeah. Somebody else was saying this too. Somebody else, you know, I'm not going to say who. But this person was like, you know, I think we should do the Super Bowl. I think we should get it here and do our Super Bowl. Somebody said, great minds think alike. And yeah. Also, people are being strategic now. Yeah, unfold a big banner. Sweetie pie, yeah. People will see that and be like, whoa. Got the Super Bowl too. Yeah. We don't always need entertainers to come to, you know, the rescue and to vouch for something, make something pop. Sometimes we can do it, individuals. The individual, ordinary American citizen can make something pop. You have a bunch of people go out there and make a scene for reparations, that's going to pop. The ordinary citizen can do it. Yeah. Sometimes we abdicate our power and responsibility to other people. We're like, we're powerless, but this celebrity, they can do it. No. Nah. You can get off your ass and do it too. If you're in Vegas, that'd be a fun activity to do. You can get to meet other people. You say, how would you plan for it? Have a meetup. Use the tools and resources that's already available. Have a Super Bowl 53 meetup. You don't have to say what it's for. When you get there, then that's when you talk with the people about what it's really for. Yeah. Plan it out for who's going to do what. See, this is, this is really, we're talking really sophisticated stuff now. We're not talking about little leagues anymore. This is the big league. Plan out who's going to do what. Have the lawyers ready. Yeah. If anybody gets into any trouble, Make sure they have a lawyer. Yeah. Call it needed. Yeah. Do I think that that would work? Yeah, I think it would work. Yeah. It would, you know, things are going to, you know, have multiple purposes and reasons why they might and might not work. It could not work, though. It's possible. I don't see how, though, because it's going to get picked up and reported. Especially if people make a spectacle in the scene. Look here. I'm going, I'm going to cut to the chase. I see every day folks knowing how to make a scene when it's not important. When it's not something vital to their own best interest. I see folks making a scene. So you're telling me something that's going to be vital to your best interest and your children's children's best interest. You can't make a scene? Please spare me. Now, people can make a scene in a spectacle. If it's one thing all Americans can do, they can make a spectacle. You don't need a celebrity for that. You all make spectacles every day. Yeah. I look at 
the news every day it has to be people making spectacles of themselves. Oftentimes, not in good ways. This would be good trouble. This would be getting into good trouble. Yeah, this is going to be interesting. I think some folks are doing, I'm hearing glamour and chatter. I'm hearing moans that people want to be here. I'm here to, you know, strongly encourage you to do something. If you're listening to this and you're planning to be out in Las Vegas for the Super Bowl, Please, I fully endorse a spectacle. Make it big. Make it grand. Make it something everybody remembers. The Super Bowl is on February 11, 2024. If we can hijack that Super Bowl for five minutes, Two minutes, 60 seconds. Think about how that's going to catch on. Think about how many times people go look at that clip on the internet. Yeah. Millions upon millions of views. Think about how many reporters are going to talk about it. Yeah. It's time to go make some noise again in this republic, you all. Time to make some noise. You know, it's been too quiet for too long. And that's why we've got the situation with complacency and apathy. Yeah. 24 is about making noise. I know people in other times are going to make some noise, but this is a moment, a cherry pick moment, hand picked out. We can really make a scene. Yeah. And really send a loud and clear message to everybody watching that we in this operation mean business. Yeah, we mean big business. Yeah. That means huge. If I'm somewhere and I hear reports that you all on February the 11th made a spectacle in support of reparations, I'm going to be like, oh boy, well, I'll be there. I'll be like, damn, the kids are making noise. We need to make noise again. It needs to be loud. We need to send a clear message right off the bat to these folks. We are not messing around anymore. Yeah. Yeah. Las Vegas. If you all know where the hell you are, you all just go make some noise outside. They'll pay attention. Yeah. yeah, they'll start paying attention. And once a bunch of people start making a little bit noise, you know what happens. Especially here. Then everybody gonna come outside and make noise. And that's what's gonna happen in March. You know the lady that told me it's just gonna be 20 people. She started seeing noise at the Super Bowl. She started seeing a commission get named and selected. Then it's going to hit different. She might want to come outside and make some noise. By the time it's over, everybody's going to be outside making noise. Because 24 is it. This is it. I can't stress that enough. This is it. Make sure that they cannot mix you. Because you know they'll try to miss it on purpose. 
You might have to, you know, improvise. Yeah, somebody said, we know what you mean. Yeah, you might have to improvise. You know what I mean. You know exactly what I mean. Yeah, the Super Bowl, that'd be something else. Watch a clip on the internet of the Super Bowl 2023. Oh, is that you all in the stands making noise, clowning, making a spectacle? Oh, the whole year, they're going to say, here come the Americans again. Yeah. Yeah, here they come making noise again. It's been a long time. A long, long time. It's going to be unmistakable. Unmistakable. Somebody said it's going to be unmistakable. They're going to see us. Yeah. I know how y'all live. Everybody know how they go. Let's just make it happen. 